So here I have my photo open in Photoshop. You can use Lightroom if you prefer. Um, I'm going to crop it to fit the board, just slightly larger than the board that we're going to be using. And uh, I'm going to edit the contrast, well, the levels and brightness. So here I'm just, I'm picking a square, crops uh, square, and I'm going to crop that. Maybe move her around a little bit. And then I'm going to rotate the image because I want her at the bottom. And I see that there's a bit of floor left over at the top that I just want to get rid of. So I'm going to draw a new square around here and craft to that. Then I'm going to change my image or adjust the contrast and levels and curves. I want the image a little bit brighter than what I see on this, than what I envision in my final proje project. Um, I'm going to be adding color to this using pastel. So I want the pastel to be able to show, uh, come through the image. Um, and then image size. So I'm going to change this uh, to 200 pixels per inch. Um, that's what most printers print at. Um, and then I'm going to change the, the size of the image to 6.2. Uh, the boards we will be using are 6 by 6 inches. So I want it just a little bit bigger than the board so that I have some leeway of how I'm going to use it. And then from here, I can print. Um, so I'll show you how to make a carrier sheet for your uh, image. Um, first, I'm going to save it. I realized that I don't want to save the image I want to save as. So I'm just going to go back on this for in a second. I'm going to save it somewhere where I can find it, of course, with a file name that I can easily locate later. I did save it as a JPEG. Um, And there I'm just checking to make sure that there is enough paper on either side of the image that I'll be able to cut it out um, when I go to print. And I always print a test page, um, so just on plain paper to make sure that all the, the levels are right, the colors are right. And I did find that uh, once I printed it, I realized that I didn't print in black and white, um, so I had to change the the image colors.